Hello everybody, welcome to Mishiyaj video tutorials. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make C to C square or C to C stitch. C to C to C means corner to corner. So what you have to do is you have to start with the corner and it goes like this by increasing and when you have to decrease it goes decreasing and it becomes a square or you can also make a rectangle with this C to C stitch. It's very easy to make so let's start. For this what you have to do is first you have to make chain 6, 1, 2, 3, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Into the 4th chain you have to make double crochet. 1, double crochet. Into the next chain you have to make another double crochet. And one more double crochet. So now in total what you have three DCs, oh sorry, uh, yes, three double crochets and the chain three will be count as the first double crochet. Now, again you are going to make six chains, one, two, three, four, five and five and six. Once you have made six chains, you have to turn your work and if you are not turning, it's fine. See, you have one, two, three, four, five, six chains. Again, in the fourth chain, you have to make double crochet. Second double crochet. And this is our third double crochet. Once you have made three double crochets, you have to attach your this little square with the chain, third chain of the first square you made, like this. And you have to make a slip stitch like this. Again, you are going to make chain three and now what you have to do, you have to make three double crochets in this three chain space which you made in the first square. I hope it's somewhat clear. So now you can see it's increasing like this and it's going row by row. Now what you have to do, you again have to make six chains and in the fourth chain you are going to do double crochet double crochet in the fifth chain and double crochet in the sixth chain now you have something like this you have to turn your work and attach it with the slip stitch. Moving on, chain 3 and 3 double crochets in the 3 chains that are count as the first double crochet of our last row, previous row. And attach it like this. Again, you are going to chain 3 and 3 double crochets into the previous rows, 3 chain space. So, see, it's corner to corner. We are going to increase corner to corner. Moving on, now, after, again, in every row what you have to do chain 6 and increase so it is going to increase like this now while you have to decrease what you have to do while decreasing now this is the point to understand that while we are decreasing what we have to do we don't have to make chains rather we have to do slip stitch 
single uh, sorry we have to do single crochets into the three double crochets of our previous row once you have done three double crochets you are here at the end of this and you have to make three chains and three double crochets into the last previous rows three chain space now you have to make slip stitch into the previous row chain 3 and 3 double crochets attach it with the single crochet so now we are at the corner so what we have to do this is the decreasing part so when you are at the decreasing part you are not going to chain 3 and do 3 double crochets in the last one but that's the end of our row and when now we are going to uh, start another row of decreasing so we are going to turn our work around and do single crochets to reach till the place space we have over here Once we have reached over here, you can see. See now the corner is decreasing like this. Chain three and three double crochets. Once you have done three double crochets, attach it like this to the. Previous row, and here you go. You have a corner to corner square. This is how it looks. This is called corner to corner. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope it's useful, and uh, do subscribe to our channel and do comment below. Thank you so much.